What I have learned in the last four days is disgusting. It's sick. It is sick. Local animal activist Jill Parrish is the one who filed a police report after hearing about an incident involving Preston Junior High science teacher Robert Crossland. A teacher told her that last week after school, Mr. Crossland fed a live puppy who was reportedly sick to one of his reptiles. He has a snake and a snapping turtle, and apparently it all happened in front of students. Allowing children to watch an innocent baby puppy scream because it is being fed to an animal. That is violence. That is not okay. Esty Hull is a seventh grader at Preston Junior High. I've only heard him like feed like mice or birds to his animals. I feel a little bit better that it was a puppy that was going to die, not just a healthy puppy. A sentiment echoed by some parents. If it was a deformed puppy and it was going to die anyway, Cross is very much circle of life. He's the best science teacher Preston Junior High has. Every Franklin time, County Sheriff David Fryer time, right? says the department is looking into it. We're investigating the facts and turn it over to the prosecutor, and he's the one that will determine if the law has been broken. The superintendent tells me that Mr. Crossland is still employed here at Preston Junior High, and while the incident is under investigation, he has not been placed on administrative leave. Even if the puppy was going to die, Jill doesn't think this was the way to do it. There's a lot of humane things that you can do. Feeding a live animal to a reptile is not humane and it is not okay. But other parents say it's just a hands-on way to teach the circle of life. If you're not fine with it, leave the room. Yeah. Reporting from Preston, Idaho, Dora Scheidel, Fox 13 News, Utah.